everyone. Whoops. I said that kind of fast, huh? Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Michelle. Um, I have a Mint Mongoose subscription. She's super quiet until I start talking. Um, I have a Mint Mongoose subscription for the month of December. Okay, so this is a jewelry subscription. And they just recently updated it in the last... Um, the last video I put up, I was still going back based on the past um, prices and stuff. So I've since looked at it again. I'm going to link everything below. But so the way it works, you complete a profile, um, you select what kind of jewelry you want. Do you want silver? Do you want gold, rose gold? Or do you want like a surprise where they just choose every month? Then you decide, do I want earrings or no earrings? They used to have it where you can do watches or no watches, I believe. Hey, hey, hey. And some people, you know, don't want earrings because they don't have their ears pierced. Um, but I don't see the watch part anymore. And then you choose, are you going to do like a year subscription, a six month subscription, a month to month? So month to month is $16.99. Um, and then $16.99 a set. And you get a three piece set of jewelry. Usually you get a necklace. A bracelet and earrings or two necklaces and a bracelet or two necklaces and earrings or if you don't get earrings you might just get two necklaces and a bracelet something like that um so a three-piece set and it's like cuss like she makes them at least from everything I've seen um, she creates them every month and then you can add on so I think because I was already I have like a year subscription to this I'm already all set and I don't make any changes so I was in a subscription where it was four pieces. Hey, 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 hey. They changed the four pieces to only three pieces plus a shirt. Hold on a second. Okay, so yeah, with mine, um, I guess they just, instead of doing four pieces of jewelry, they put it back to three and then we get a new t-shirt, or a t-shirt every month. Um, but if you're starting from scratch, you pick your jewelry, you pick your term, if you want earrings or not, and then you can add more on. So there's surprise bonus earrings are you an earring lover snag a bonus pair of earrings um you can get like at the beginning you can get a one-time bonus pair of earrings for $14.99 or you can add a pair of bonus earrings um surprise bonus earrings so they'll be they'll be different than like the set because they always kind of like go together the sets do and it'll be $3.99 a month rings it says you have a love for rings um it says they are sturdy but resizable. It says resizable size eight. So I guess which I've got really small fingers, but they're supposed to be all resizable. I have gotten one ring before and I wore it a ton. I really liked it. It was just simple and it, it fit me fine. And I've got tiny fingers, so I was able to resize it. So you can get a one-time ring for four ninety-nine when you sign up, or you can get it for an extra three ninety-nine and get a ring every month. And then they have the T-shirt. Um, receive a super soft t-shirt featuring a custom design based on the inspiration from the month's jewelry set. One time t-shirt is $11.99 or every month $9.99. Um, and that's it. So let's open this and I'll show you what is all in here. This month, I have no clue. Um, I will say, I got the t-shirt last month and I actually really liked it. I was surprised. It was just a basic um, kind of like a baby tee. Um, so it was tighter and it said inspire and I thought, and it was soft. It wasn't like a, I don't know. It wasn't like a, it, it was a soft t-shirt and I liked that. And I, um, I wore it and I was like, this is actually pretty comfy. I ended up wearing it to bed. It was so comfy. So this is how it comes now. If you get a t-shirt, it's got a little sticker. They have the t-shirt wrapped up and they did ask my size and I did email them. And, um, so I can change that if I want. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, so this month, it's just, see, it's like a baby tee. I think that's what they're called, right? Like a junior's tee. Um, anyways, so it's like a little house, cabin in the woods type of thing printed on. But it's a very, it's a very nice, soft material. What is this? 60% cotton, 40% polyester machine washable oh I just washed mine too and I didn't check to see if it's only I don't think it should shrink too bad if it's 60% cotton but we'll see I, I'm never good at figuring that out but this is really cute I like this 
Um, I'm kind of like considering seeing it, like upping it to XL. <laughs> Not because I need it, but just because then it'll be even oversized on me and I'd like that. Um, okay, they always give you a Werther's Original every time, which is a fun little treat. And then your jewelry comes in here. Then you get a card. On the back of the card shows you everything you're getting in the box and a description. And then there's always a picture. And this is matches the tea. I've gotten some really cute postcards and I've actually like, I'm gonna hang them up because they're really pretty pictures. So I try not to look at the what's, you know, coming until I open it because I like to be surprised. So let me open this up. Okay, then they've got it all packaged up. Thank you from Mint Mongoose. And then they say, um, be sure to share photos or video of your new favorite Mint Mongoose jewelry pieces and tag hashtag Mint Mongoose to be entered to win a free month. So they've got everything all wrapped up individually. So each package has a little card. Um, spend $40 on individual items in our online shop and receive your next box free. Oh, and that's another thing. They have a shop that you can order a lot of this stuff from. Um, they really pack, I feel like they go a little overboard on the packaging, but you know, nothing ever comes broken. I haven't, I don't think I've ever gotten any. I think one time like the earrings wasn't all like, I just had to put it back together. It just came apart, but it wasn't like nothing was broken. Um, Okay, so the first necklace, oh, that's cute. Okay, so these are the chains they use. Nothing fancy, just simple, you know, but I like this. It has multiple lengths on all their chains. And this is the, this is this month. That's really cute. It's like a little diamond. I actually expect, I've only ever seen them hanging this way, sideways. So I kind of like that it's, or you know, instead of um, long ways like this, it's sideways, it's different. One thing I've noticed too, so this is really cute. It's really sparkly. One thing I've noticed though, on a lot of their jewelry pieces, let's say it's like, I don't know, let's say, Maybe you're not into sparkles and you're like, eh, it's a little too much. I'm not going to wear it. Flip it over because the back always has kind of a cool design. And I always think that would look cute too. It's not just salt. They always have some kind of design on the back and you could easily wear that instead. All right, let's just put this on. See how it looks on. I mean, it kind of blends in with my shirt. I should have worn like a, a color. You know, what? let me put this shirt on. Hold on. Okay. So you can see the fit kind of hard to see it is long it's nice and long which is good I'm short so like my pants come up to here my belly buttons right here so it's pretty long um, comfortable it's like a tighter fitting shirt and then my little necklace I could I'd probably want to wear it this long I'd probably pull it up a little um, and then let's see what else we got oh that's cute okay so here's another necklace Oops, it's a little twisted you know what I noticed these um, chains don't get twisted as badly so it's just a basic circle but I like that it's in I just bought another necklace like this but the circle is a little bigger I don't know it's simple and again they have the extension so you don't have to wear it um, you can wear it short I love that I can't tell you how many times I go to put a necklace on and I'm like, gosh, I wish it just had a little bit more, um, just a little bit more length, you know? I like that they all have like five little circles to extend. I really like this one. This one, this one I feel like is more specialty. I don't know how often I'll wear this. This one I'll wear a lot. And then, which is kind of exciting because the next piece, oh, oh, it's totally different than I thought. Oh no, 
Well, that's a bummer. Okay. They didn't. <laughs> this is the next piece. This is the earring. So it's the circle with the little um, thing. So you could wear it kind of like all together as a set. But this one is missing this part. It, I got one once and it came apart um, and I just put it back together. This one didn't even have it this time. So it's missing like the little earring hanger. That's cute. I would, I might even just wear it like this without um, this one. I don't know, it's cute though. So I might have to email them because that's weird. So it must have fallen out. Yeah, didn't fall out here. It wasn't in the bag. <laughs> But they also always provide these little clear things to put on the earring back too for all the dangly earrings, which I love because, I don't know, sometimes they slip. So sometimes I like to put those on. Um, okay, now let me read about this month. So she, ooh, this would have been pretty. So um, here it is in the silver, the rose gold, and the gold. I kind of like gold, believe it or not, even though I'm not much of a gold person. And the pieces together. And then, so her inspiration, she wrote, Hi there, this month's set is inspired by, you guessed it, the roller coaster that was 2020 and how, despite the ups and downs, you made it through. Um, <coughs> the set. Since we set out our first set 50 months ago. Wow, I didn't realize they'd been in business that long. And then she wrote, Man, time flies. Lovely ladies worldwide have been asking for a geo-inspired necklace. The closing out of 2020 seemed like the perfect time to fulfill those long time requests. I'm sure I'm not sure where I got the saying, but somewhere along the wild ride of life, the following words came to me, and they are ones I have found comfort and strength in throughout the years. Sometimes uh, all we can control is this life in our perspective. Wait, sometimes all we can control in this life is our perspective, but sometimes we can control more. For me, these were words that popped in my head through many roller coaster moments over the last year. That's so true. I gotta say that, that's so true. Our perspective of it. We can look at it as we're stuck at home, there's a pandemic, people are dying, this sucks. And maybe not even the people are dying thing. I know people are, but I'm saying like, we can just feel sorry for ourselves. My fam family's happy, we're not sick, you know. We're stuck home, that sucks. Or we can look at it as, you know what, at least we're healthy. Thank, thank goodness we're healthy, thank God we're healthy. Yeah, we're stuck home, but we have time together, you know. Yeah, it sucks not being able to go out or, you know, we're bored, um, the kids are going stir crazy, but it's we're learning how to bond, you know. I don't know, um, okay. Let's see, so much has happened in the last year for all of us. Some good things, some not so good things, and some tragic things all rolled, in, old, rolled into 12 months of life. The hundreds of different fa facets on the gems of this set are meant to resemble all of our different perspectives there are in this world. Oh, okay. Um, in my opinion, the ability to control how you look at things along with the ability to consider the perspectives of others is such a vital skill to hone in this life. That is so true. With these tools, navigating difficult situations can sometimes be a little less difficult. Pain can be lessened, progress can be increased, and goodness can come sooner th rather than later. The circles in this set were meant to be a fun contrast to the main gems and resemble a monocule to emphasize the value and perspective adjustment offers and can't wait. Let me start, I can't. The circles in this set were meant to be a fun contrast to the main gems and resembles a monocule to emphasize the value and perspective adjustment offers and can sometimes make all of the difference in brightening your days and the days of those around you. I don't, the sentence doesn't make sense to me, but I got it, I'll read it back later. As we move on from the experience we characterize as 2020, I pray your perspective is that of hope, excitement, and the glass being half full. Heart Helen, the smiley face behind Mongoose. Um, 
see, I always like the jewelry more after I read her little note. I don't know. It always makes me like things more. Because I like that she puts so much thought into everything, you know? It could just be, oh, I wanted to make a circle necklace, you know? But no, she, she goes into it. Um, but I totally agree, you know, trying to see other people's perspectives. Because I know people that can't understand someone else's perspective and it's been it's been really hard for me to get that because I am I guess like a very empathetic person and if I see someone's hurting even if I don't know them it just hurts me and so I don't understand always like people like there's so much bashing going on with um with everything this year, there's been so much bashing, like the vote, you know, with voting, people bash someone for voting for the wrong person. They bash people for not voting, not understanding, not being educated enough. You know, it just like, I don't know. I just thought it was sad. Um, I feel with anything, you just educate, don't bash. I don't know. Cause I feel like you do that and then people just get upset and it doesn't help anything. Uh, I watched this. Okay, come here, I'll fix it. I watched, I looked, I was on the Instagram yesterday. The Instagram. I'm old. Okay. Um, and it's all brown. Okay, bring it to me. The tablet's brown. I came across this woman, and she had this really cute picture of her and her little girl. And her little girl was around. Oh, your tablet's going to die, I think. Yeah. We need to put it on the charger. Um... I think we left it on. I forgot. We left it on a cartoon a couple hours ago. And we weren't watching the cartoon. Here, you can yeah. use this one. Um, anyways, I came across this Instagram. And it was, she put up this really cute, um, okay, here you go. This really cute picture of her and her daughter holding her daughter. And her daughter was like my daughter's age. Yes, go up there, please. Don't get anything on it. Um, was my daughter's age. My little one. Um, two, three, four. I want to say like three so I think she's right around the age or was and I was like oh what a cute picture and so I started reading her little the information under it what she'd written and I'm reading it and I'm reading it and it didn't say things clearly but I come to find out that I guess her little daughter had passed away at the beginning or earlier this year sometime so I went on her page and of course I was like oh my gosh that's so sad I hope I'm not right and sure enough, you know, she, I guess they, at the, earlier in the year, her daughter got diagnosed with a brain tumor, and it just, I just lost it. And it's not, I don't even know her. Don't know her, never met her, never seen her before. It's just the thought of it, like, I can't. And my husband gets on me because he's like, you got to stop reading sad stories <laughs> because it gets me. And I'm like, but I can't help it. You know, I want to help or I don't know, do something. I mean, you, in that, uh, in that, um, situation, I can't do anything, you know, but I don't know. So it's hard for me sometimes when people don't have that. And my husband's one of them. He, he definitely is one of them. He is the, a kind, kind person. Um, he's a really good husband, really good, uh, father and friend and extremely kind and giving and caring but he has a hard time understanding things if he hasn't lived through it like for instance um like having a panic attack he never understood even if you explain it he just didn't get it he was like eh, it's just whatever you're you're making it up you're fine you're over exaggerating type of thing until he had one and then he was like i am so sorry i am so sorry i never knew it was like that you know so, but I guess some people just, they're not, I feel like you either have that ability or you don't, no matter how you, how much you try. I don't know. To like be able to feel and, you know, you either feel what other people feel or you don't. I don't think it's like something, so I don't fault anyone for it, but I just say let's not be mean. I'm kind of like talking in circles and going from thing to thing, aren't I? All right. I'm going to stop talking. Let me know what you guys think of the jewelry. Thank you so much for listening and watching and clicking and following me. And thank you for being you. You guys are awesome. Have a beautiful day.